Uh, are you with me? Can you hear me? Flimity Jim Jams, I hope so. You guys have with me? You gotta make this quick. I don't know how long it's gonna take before my my computer succumbs to the uh, troubles of Windows 10 and whatever else is going on with it. I will try to figure this out. Um, I swear, I swear to you, stream. Um, I first off, I want to apologize. There's not gonna be a spooky Halloween story time like I promised because uh, my mom's not feeling well. She's gone to bed. But she wanted to wish you all, you know, a lovely evening. And I'm sure she would tell you Happy Halloween. I think she might actually be outside, uh, with the dog right now, but... The dogs. But, yeah. So, I'm sure we'll get some spooky story time with her later, and, you know, have her come read stories with us later, because I know she really enjoys that. But let's get, let's see what's up with our mystery game. So, for those of you who've forgotten already, um, Russell started a fire with his mind, presumably. The church burns, the flowers burn, even their bodies burn, and you flee into the night of a new moon. Yes, those children burned as easily as flower petals. I despise you, boy. <gasps> oh, dang! These are the flames of anger, full of my sadness and hatred, and prayers for the children. You! Prepare yourself! Matchbox appeared. Burying woman appeared. Matchbox appeared. That woman... I think I've... I... I don't want to fight! I don't want to fight her! Cody, don't think about it! For the good... For the people of this town, in God's name, I shall purge you! Oh, Cody entered the fight unsure! I love that. I think it might be their mom. I'm thinking we did burn a church and I think that this might be their mom. That's a nice effect though, her entering on... Hang on, I want to put this on... Let me find the headphones. It's a good, it's a good jam. No, Carrie, it's not time. You're right. You're right. We'll appreciate the jams in this game later more thoroughly because they are nice. I enjoy these jams. Get it together. Cody can't even fight right now. Unsure is like being paralyzed. I guess. Burying one. So they've all been like, you know, various ones.
I barely knew what burnt up. Alone, I prayed to God. I made grace. It was not they who should have been burned at the stake. It is you, boy. It is you. The tree bearing one is sitting on went up in flames. Oh, she's turning into the uh, the hysteric, the Miss Hysteric. Cody and Dogma are both unsure now, and almost dead. Oh shoot, I didn't mean to... They're gonna die. You're gonna die too, Jeez Louise. Oh, we're both about to die. That's great. That's fantastic. I love that. We're all almost dead. No, get out of here. By the way, if this fight doesn't come through well in the broadcast, I will replay it for you guys. Oh wait, Dogma can heal. Can you hear all of us? Whatever, it's better to hold on to it. Well, that was my, uh... Oh wait, no, I've got one more. Don't freaking die this time, you piece of junk. I might be a little under-leveled for this fight. Perhaps. God. I screwed up, dang. Ooh, 40 HP all! Well, it's good the stream is going well because my fight is not. Maybe I can make it weaker. Just keep shooting it, dude. 
There was a small church at the edge of town. It was a pretty church with pure white walls and lively vines wrapped around it. I often went there to pray. I always saw the slightly stuffy priest and his apparent little sister chatting. Damn it! Dogma, you're slow. I don't know if you're going to be able to do this in time to actually have it affect Russell, but that would be sure be nice. Okay, it's not like this isn't anything we already knew. I mean, it was pretty, pretty clear that we burned down a church. Let's eat another healthy carrot salad. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna have... Yeah, you're the second fastest, so it's fine. It'll be fine. I'm gonna let you defend for a round. Good night, Mom! Yeah. You, wanna, you wanna say everybody hi? Hi, everybody. I hope you have a happy Halloween. Yeah. You guys, too. What? Yeah, but Mori's not here right now. She's actually, she's actually revisiting. She's actually in the same. Oh my god, even the game is lagging. What did I do? Okay. Yeah, the drop rate has gone up through the roof. Like uh, we are, we are, we are losing so fast. Wasn't affected. Oh, I guess that happened last time. Sung a darkness song. Hey! That's convenient. Um. So, boss is. In, oh, wait, no. It's not convenient because we actually used the pill, so now it's just down 10. I was gonna say, wow, it gave us 10, it gave us 10 MP, but no, it actually just took away 10. We had actually raised it already.
Let's just survive through this. Those people wear crosses around their necks. Did those people despise anyone? Well, we know who this girl despises. Would they be forgiven no matter what they did? If repenting can forgive anything, then... Late at night, I went to the church, poured a lot of gasoline around it, quietly set fire to it, and went home. No one saw. The cover of night protected me. Oh, okay, yeah, Mom was here briefly. Yeah, this game has some nice jams. All of the jams were made by the game's creator, except for, like the one in the hospital, I think. The monsters vanished. 196 experience. Got 16 walnuts. Rosary obtained. Cody to level 7. Plant surprise learned. Where are the police in this town? Yeah, I don't know what his motivation is. Did, did we beat her? It seems that way. Who would have thought that such a thing slumbered in Dead Tree Hill? This is bad for the heart. But but things are safe for now. Let's tell the people in town. How has he murdered this many people and not gotten caught multiple times? I don't know. I want to know what Plant Surprise does, is what I want to know. Type 2 only. Medium damage plus falter to one enemy. I gotta get you a Type 2 weapon. So we can see what Plant Surprise animation looks like. A destroyed sculpture. I was stunned to come back from the Incarna Market and find the town full of plants. To be honest, I laughed a little. But, well, not that I can't sleep, yes. Will you rest as well? I'll let you stay for free. Good job sleeping in that bed. Oh well, take care. Vines are wrapped around the bed. People in town are all still gone. Wait, is that a present? Present, 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 present. Nice. What's that? A woman on Dead Tree Hill. So that woman was the one who did that to Dark Cover Town? A brown haired, red eyed woman. Just judging from that, it sounds a bit like the siblings there. Ah, uh, sorry if I hurt your feelings. Oh my, oh my! Is it true peace has returned? How wonderful! Yes, let's not move after all, because it's just a pain, you know? Maybe because of the guilty fit, why should they be forgiven if I can't? Ah, so you gave rest to the sculptures around town. Thank you. I heard their screams from here. They were crying, weren't they? So hot. They couldn't breathe. Flowers burn easily. Even flowers offered in mourning. On that night, they must have burned along with them. Woohoo! 
father and your merry band. So you killed the monster on Dead Tree Hill. Oh, thank you very much. Now peace should return to Dark Cover Town. Th truly, I can't thank you enough. Oh, yes. It's a sign of our gratitude. Take this, please. Received sleep guide. But with all said and done, just what was that monster, do you suppose? At any rate, I believe we'll cut down that ill-fated tree tomorrow. So that such a thing as this will never happen again. Sheesh. What a calamity. I'm just glad everyone is safe. I really wasn't sure what was going to happen there. Good thing you were there. Here, Russell. Are you sure it's a good thing I was here? Ah. That reminds me. Why were you in this town? I didn't get to talk to the guy over there. A young couple alone. D don't tell me. Yeah, that's right. Co that's right, Dog Bubby and Cody were going to go make out at Dead Tree Hill. Hey, don't make weird assumptions. We, um, this and that happened and we were looking for you. For me? Why? Because I, um, I'm sorry. They got to set you in the church. I messed up and broke it. What? What? Wait, you mean the one in front of the pipe organ? Yes, that one. I'm sorry. <sighs> oh well then. Uh, all material things must break eventually, after all. Besides, the dedication you showed today, it was a just thing that brings no shame to the Lord. As such, I am sure you will be forgiven. You, you think? I hope so. I wouldn't say it if it weren't true. Well then, let us return. It has gotten quite late. I can't wait to see your charred corpses. Good. Dogma forgave me. Thanks for today, Russell. You were a lot of help. If you need help with anything, you can call me, okay? I, I have to repay you somehow. Well, let's head home. So it's probably already night over there. Cody, Dogma, and Helpers left the party. Alright, that monster is dead! You guys killed it for us? Thank you so much. I kinda panicked earlier. I'm regretting saying some things I didn't really mean. Drinking during the day, littering trash, dipping into my wife's secret savings. I'll probably still do it. Maybe. When he's actually frowning, it kind of looks like a weird smirk. I, it's actually just like a, a very straight face, but yeah. I'm not going to turn I can't tell her I broke it last week and just glued it back together. I almost expected him to say something like that, honestly. Here, 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 Russell. Let's, uh... Oh, it lowers our defense, but... Gives us more mind. I can't wait to take- you know what I'm gonna do? Oh, I can't forget, I have to take Gardini back to party place. I'm gonna take these kids back to this hill every day, too. We're gonna constantly go back here. I want you guys to relive your mom burning. Nighttime at the market. But just like people, we also feel tired and must sleep, so keep that in mind. Ah, no, no, hold it right there. This area is off limits at night. You see, during the night, we're in here checking our proceeds and the quality of our goods. So keep out! Sorry, sorry. What about my cat friends? What are they up to at night? Big tummy. 
Whoa! Who are you? Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. This dream will teach you the weight of your sin. Oh, all right. So I guess this is happening. Let's take Dogma to our swank bathhouse and also the movie. So this is happening. All right. What a cheerful song. Not at all creepy. Yeah, we, we actually just ran, ran into the shadow um, while heading to Drug Cat Town. And it told us with like wide spaced um, words This dream will teach you the weight of your sin. Yo! Yo! Well, that happened. Guess who forgot to save? I didn't. I didn't anticipate this. I didn't. I didn't think this would happen. I. My bad. Well, I mean... They have to kill their mother a guest time and that a second time, I guess. Good to know, though. Don't want to touch that thing. But yeah, we're really picking this back up once we, uh... Crap! Crap! 
I'm still really shitty at fighting this thing. Maybe I should just go maybe I should stop. We have to see these cool jams again. Gosh dang it. I'm still really bad at paying attention to their health in this game. I'm sorry. Oh, come on! This is brutal! We did! We did! I like how the, the nightmare fight is the game over music the entire time, though. Is there a way to fight the nightmare? To, like, actually be it? I'm really curious now, because we did no damage, it wail on us up in fierce. Maybe this is the sign that we should stop the night, though. We got to see it, even if it didn't save. I'll, we'll, we'll give it another go whenever I'm less dumb at fighting this. Maybe one of those skills- I was thinking that maybe one of those skills like sadness or something would have an effect. You know, you'd think with all the games that we've played that I would know better than to just go saunter up to a shadow and try to make friendly conversation with it. Because dealing with shadows in the past has not gone well for our protagonists. Normally they try to actively kill us, as this one has done. I should have known. You know, normally they chase us down and kill us. I, I should have... Gosh, what was I thinking? Anyway, I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful Halloween. And I'll see you again on uh, Thursday when we will pick this game back up. Hopefully with less trouble. I mean, gosh, I hope... I, I Fingers crossed. We'll deal with... Uh, We'll deal with their parent, with the, with the Dogma and Cody's mom, um, presumably. Um, and see see what sort of effects we have. And we'll take Cody and Dogma to the uh, to the movies and to the young, to the uh, bathhouse. And it was requested to send uh, Gardenia and Dogma, so we'll definitely do that too. It should be great. I can't... I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait to take more friends to have fun adventures with me. You guys have a wonderful evening, and thank you for joining me. It's been a... it's been a technical... technically challenged Halloween, but I'm really excited about the game we... the games we played. And I can't wait to play them more competently. Well, technologically competently. I can't. I can't promise anything on my end as far as actual skill at playing games. But hopefully, I can get that worked out and we can continue and roll and continue boogieing. I'll see you guys later. Tell. Yeah, it looks like it did.